I get some absolutely terrific ideas from those of you leaving comments, and the day's project is another terrific idea, which is to use a can of starting fluid to power this lawnmower. So instead of using gasoline, I'm going to spray starting fluid directly in the carburetor, keeping this engine running. And this is an 11 ounce can. We're gonna run the entire can through this engine, and we're gonna see if this causes damage to the engine, or if it's urban legend that starting fluid will damage an engine. Why might starting fluid damage an engine? There's several theories. One theory is that starting fluid dries out the cylinder walls, causing scoring to take place. So before we get started, what we're going to do is take a look at the cylinder walls, see what kind of condition they're in. Additionally, we're going to measure the compression before we run the engine with starting fluid, and then we're going to take a measurement afterwards. Today should be a really interesting project. Okay, we just finished running an entire can through this engine. With that said, a lot of it ended up um, missing the carburetor. So I know what a lot of you are thinking, will an engine run on starting fluid? And if it does run on starting fluid, what will happen to the engine? Will it cause damage? So what we're going to do now is actually spray starting fluid into an empty fuel tank and run it on straight starting fluid. This just looks like an oily film on the engine is all this is. This really isn't much of a carbon buildup. Well, I have to admit, I'm pretty surprised that starting fluid didn't do any damage to this small engine. With that said, as you noticed, I went ahead and ran an entire can through the carburetor. I realized that some of that didn't make it into the engine, but I ran it for a good six minutes of spraying it into the carburetor. Additionally, I added almost the entire can of the starting fluid into the actual fuel tank and ran this engine for a solid 20 minutes. So in all, close to 30 minutes of runtime, and it didn't cause any damage. With that said, do you think starting fluid will do long-term damage to an engine? I realize we, this is not a long-term test, um, also, do you think starting fluid could cause damage to a diesel? As you know, diesels have a much higher compression ratio. I really enjoy reading your comments. I hope that you'll take time to post a comment and give me some more project ideas. You guys have a lot of terrific project ideas. Finally, I put a lot of effort in these videos. I hope I've earned a thumbs up. And you guys also give me some very good professional uh, constructive feedback. So I also look forward to your comments on ways that I can improve the quality of these videos. 
Anyway, just want to say thank you very much for watching the video and really look forward to seeing you next time.